And now, Mr. Secretary, if you would read the citation. The President of the United States of America, authorized by Act of Congress March 3, 1863, has awarded in the name of the Congress the Medal of Honor to Sergeant First Class Fred W. Zabotowski, United States Army, for conspicuous gallantry and intrepidity in action at the risk of his life above and beyond the call of duty. Sergeant First Class Fred W. Zabotowski, United States Army, distinguished himself in the Republic of Vietnam on February 19, 1968, while serving as an assistant team leader of a nine-man Special Forces long-range reconnaissance patrol. Sergeant Zabotowski's patrol was operating deep within enemy-controlled territory when it was attacked by a numerically superior North Vietnamese Army unit. Realizing the gravity of the situation, Sergeant Zabotowski ordered his patrol to move to a landing zone for helicopter extraction while he covered their withdrawal with rifle fire and grenades. Rejoining the patrol under increasing enemy pressure, he continually moved from man to man, encouraging them and controlling their defensive fire. Mainly due to his example, the outnumbered patrol maintained his precarious position until the arrival of tactical air support and a helicopter extraction team. As the rescue helicopters arrived, the determined North Vietnamese pressed the, their attack. Sergeant Zabotowski repeatedly exposed himself to adjust helicopter gunship fire around the landing zone. After boarding one of the rescue helicopters, he positioned himself in the door, delivering fire on the enemy as the ship took off. The helicopter was engulfed in a hail of bullets, and Sergeant Zabotowski was thrown from the craft as it spun out of control and crashed. Recovering consciousness, he ignored his painful injuries and moved to the flaming wreckage. Heedless of the danger of exploding ordnance and fuel, he pulled the severely wounded pilot from the blaze and made repeated attempts to rescue his, pat his patrol members, but was driven back by the intense heat. Despite his own serious burns and crushed ribs, he carried and dragged the unconscious pilot through a curtain of enemy fire to within 10 feet of a hovering rescue helicopter before collapsing. Sergeant Zabotowski's extraordinary heroism and devotion to duty are in keeping with the highest traditions of the military service and reflect great credit upon himself, his unit, and the United States Army. This family is from New Jersey, uh, Trenton, New Jersey, right? Yes, sir. And uh, the, uh, your boy said that when he came in, that you, you tell him what you told me. He says his teacher said, say hello. <laughs> He's going to go far with his teacher. <laughs> He's in the first grade. That concludes the ceremony. We thank you all very much for coming, and we are honored that you could be here to participate in this very historic ceremony.